How to download GTA 5 to your PC or laptop. Welcome to another Gaging Gadgets tutorial video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to download and install GTA 5 on your PC or laptop so then you can start playing it. And if this video helps you, please consider giving it a like and subscribing to my channel because that really helps me out. Now, before we get started, it's important to note that GTA 5 costs money. It is a paid game, so in order to play it, you have to buy it. So in this tutorial, I'll show you how to first buy GTA 5 and then install it to your PC. All right, so to get started, the first thing we need to do is simply open up a browser on our computer and navigate to gta5.com. Now check the description, I'll have a direct link down there. Once gta5.com loads, it'll take us to Rockstar Games, which is the creator of GTA 5. From here, all we need to do is go up into the top right and select Buy Now, and then scroll down and under GTA 5 on the right side, you just wanna choose Select Platform, and then choose PC. Once this loads, we once again just want to select PC and select Buy Now. And as you can see, it's $29.99 US. Now that we've selected to buy GTA 5 for our PC, we simply need to either log in to our Rockstar Games Social Club account. If you don't already have an account, you can also sign in using different services such as Xbox or PlayStation. I don't already have an account, so I'm going to just create a new one. Once you create your account or log in, You'll then be brought back to where we need to choose PC and select Buy Now again. And now we can go through the process of purchasing GTA 5. And you can use a credit card or debit card or any of these payment services such as PayPal. Once you finish going through that process, you'll see that you've purchased GTA 5. You can then close this window. It'll bring us back here where all we need to do is under PC, select Go to Rockstar Games Launcher. And then we need to simply download the Rockstar Games Launcher so that we can install GTA 5 to our PC. So select Download for Windows, then save the Rockstar Games Launcher to your PC. Once it's done downloading, open up the Rockstar Games Launcher, and most likely this will be saved in the Downloads folder on your computer. So go ahead and open up the launcher that we just downloaded, and then we just need to go through the installation process for the Rockstar Games Launcher. So select your desired language, and then select Continue, and then select Continue. Go ahead and read through the licensing agreement and accept it if you do, and then select continue. And then with the installation location, you can leave this default and then select continue. It'll then install the launcher. And once it's done, it'll say finish and then select close. It'll then automatically open the Rockstar Games launcher and it'll then install any updates that are required to the launcher. Once the launcher opens, log in using the account you used to purchase GTA 5. If you get this screen, you can do this if you want, but if you never had any Rockstar games on your computer before, you can just select cancel, and that's what I'm gonna do. So now that the Rockstar game launcher is open and we're logged in, as you can see under my library here, we have GTA 5. So we can just select that and then choose install now. Keep in mind it is 108 gigabytes, so just make sure you have that space available. Once you're ready, select install. And then it'll go through the process of downloading and installing GTA 5 on your computer. To see the progress of the download, all you need to do is hover to the bottom of the GTA 5 launcher here, and you'll be able to see it. Once it's done downloading and installing GTA 5, you'll be able to just select play to open the game. If for some reason you don't see this, just go over to your library on the left side, select GTA 5, and then select play. You can then enable cloud saves if you'd like. This just allows you to save your game across multiple platforms or multiple devices. And it also backs up your saved games for GTA 5. So I'm going to do that. And then it will start opening and loading GTA 5. And then you'll be able to start playing GTA 5 on your PC or laptop. All right, so that's how you download and install GTA 5 on a PC or laptop. If you have any questions about this, leave a comment below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. If you'd like to see more Windows tips and tutorials, check the links in the description. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up and please consider subscribing to my channel, Gaging Gadgets, for more gadget reviews and tech tutorials. Thank you so much for watching.